running through the park. Oh, everybody's gonna die. Okay, here comes the train guns. All right, come on. Oh, don't kill my security. Oh boy, everybody run to the exits. No, oh, you're destroying the gazebo. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Barkasaurus, and yes folks, we are back once again, and today we are ready to start grinding away and trying to get ourselves a little bit bigger and a little bit better park. So last episode, uh, we have a new dinosaur here, I always call it the long neck dinosaur, I'm pretty sure it's got some sort of actual name, is that it's poo? That is huge, oh jeez, can I click on it's poo? Oh yep, it's poop, can I name it's poop? No I can't. Uh, but anyways, we had this new dinosaur, plus we have these, I think they're called oviraptors. I've got two of them back here in this cage, uh, which we'll eventually need to upgrade the fence on this, because I'm pretty sure these little things are going to eventually want to get out, and probably gnaw on some guests. So, we're going to try to prevent that. And also, we built more onto the food court, and overall, we've just unlocked a ton of stuff, which we're ready to go unlock some more stuff right now. So, we're going to go to the science screen. And let's see what we're going to be getting here today. I know I want to... Actually, there's a park size pack one. This actually has a new emission booth. Is it a bigger one or is it just to where you can add more? Hold on, let's get that real quick. Uh, I want to get a new shade pack. That way I can get some more of uh, these little awnings around the park. Uh, let's go ahead and get... Hmm, what do we want to do next? I've got TV, cooldown. A lot of these are just items for the park. I'm trying to see if there's anything that I... Uh, I really want here. Looks like you got vegan treats, scenery. How much more science do we have? We have quite a bit. I don't know, eventually I just want to unlock this whole science tree. So let's go ahead and just start working our way up from the bottom here. Uh, there we go. Alright, so that should be plenty of stuff to add to the park. Now also, I'm going to go ahead and buy the shelters here from Medium Dinosaurs. So we're going to go boom. And that's going to be with our hearts. And then I want to eventually, I don't know, I want to unlock some more dinos, but... I don't know what we're going to do about that. We might have to just keep grinding away with what we have. Or we might unlock some more this episode. We'll have to see here. But yeah, if you guys have any suggestions for this series, uh, comment below. And if you're enjoying Parkasaurus on the uh, channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel. And let's do this. All right, so look at the lines out the door. Oh, that is not good, actually. All right, so can I add another general emission booth? Or can I upgrade it? Let's see, upgrade, there we go, upgrade for 3,000, boom! So, does that mean we get in, oh, there's two now! So, look at that, we're gonna get them in a lot faster, there we go, so that's something we really needed to upgrade. Because we got plenty of potential to get people in the park, but we were having these long killer lines, and I actually think people weren't getting into the park, so... Now they're really going, man, that dinosaur just shot poo out its butt into the water. <laughs> that was epic looking. I didn't know you actually saw that. I thought it just appeared. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. Let's keep moving here. All right. So we should have some new, uh, we have some shelters now, don't we? It's for uh, medium dinosaurs or average sized. Do these count as average or what are these? Yeah, they're medium. At least they are right now. I wonder if I could stick them one of these shelters here. Maybe they'll fill a little bit better. Same with the Triceratops, they're kind of hiding too, so what if I were to go boom? Like, can you guys, why can't I place this in here? Wait, does this shelter, why does that need to be on a, uh, why does that need to be on a path? That makes no sense, I, I don't understand it, hold on. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, so it's green there, so boom. Can you guys fit in that? Oh, we'll see if they use that, we might need to research the even bigger one, but that might work. I know uh, our little long neck, he's not going to be getting in that anytime soon. Oh, thing's getting huge. Might need to make that enclosure a little bit bigger here soon. Oh, no. It is the first day of winter. I did not know about these seasons. Oh, I wonder how that affects business. I'm pretty sure it's going to make our dinos cold. Ooh, okay. We need to worry about shelters here. Get the medium dino one. I need the tiny. Actually, what are those friends? Okay, I need some shelters there for the tiny ones. What about the big ones? Our uh, sauropod. I don't know if I can get that. Oh, boy, I can't get that yet. Uh, that might be a bit of an issue. Okay. All right, well, let's go ahead and get the metal fence here. And we're getting close to unlocking it. But we need to start installing shelters because I'm pretty sure our dinos are going to get a little cold here in the winter. All right, so we can get a little shelter here for our... Ovi Raptors, let's go boom. 
All right, you guys should be able to rest in there. That doesn't even look like it's built. It looks like somebody stacked a bunch of stuff on top of the, uh, or a bunch of bricks on top of it and didn't really do anything else with it. But I guess they work. All right, we're going to get a shelter for the Triceratops. Hopefully you guys can fit in here. There we go. It's a shelter, and unfortunately I don't have a shelter for you. That's a bit of an issue. Uh, hopefully we'll be unlocking that fairly soon. Uh-oh! We got a dino on the loose! I was just digging. Uh, boy. Okay, I got security on. Who got out? No! No, okay, we need to take care of this dino real quick. Request to tranquilize. All right, so we need another one to request to tranquilize. They're killing guests! No, dinosaur rampage! We need to upgrade those fences immediately. Oh, they're running through the park. Oh, everybody's gonna die. Okay, here comes the trank guns. All right, come on. Oh, don't kill my security. Oh boy, everybody run to the exits! No, you're destroyed the gazebo! There we go, okay, that one's asleep. Let's package that. Oh boy, they finally snapped. They finally, where did the gazebo just fall from the sky? Come on, you guys need to get in there and trank those real quick. We're gonna lose some money today. All right, trank this one, please. Let's get, get it tranked here. Let's get taken care of. Okay, trank that one. We're gonna have to upgrade this pen before we release them again. They destroyed a bunch of stuff. There we go. All right, well, that's our first incident of the park. Is everybody okay? Everybody not panicking anymore? It's okay, everything's on lockdown. Oh boy, you know it is fence upgrade time. Uh, can we put this stuff back? Uh, we can request repairs. All right. Well, I guess it's time to upgrade the, uh, the fence. All right, so we're gonna have to upgrade the Triceratops area here. So obviously we're going with the stronger fence. Uh, but we're gonna give them a little bit more area, and I'm gonna go ahead and put the uh, privacy stuff towards the back here. Yeah, that was a uh, that was not good. That's the first time I've seen a uh, breakout here. So I guess it took a while, but still, we gotta be on the lookout now. Why can I not select this dead plant? All right, so we have repaired the pen. Hopefully, we can release them back out here, and we're not gonna hopefully have any issues here, folks. All right, Triceratops are back. You got a bigger pin. You got your shelter. Uh, you know what? We'll even give you an extra thing of food just to try to keep these things happy. Oh, boy, that was pretty sketchy. We need to get some toys unlocked. That's probably what they want. They probably want something to play with. While we're at it, we need to go ahead and upgrade the raptor's fence while I'm thinking about it. Oh, you know, I really wish this stream wouldn't interrupt you. I wish you could just sit there and... Uh, Click it when you need it, because I was working on the fences there. So anyways, we're going to go ahead and upgrade the raptor fences. They're probably not going to be too jazzed about that, but I really don't care today. We, we need to get this upgraded. All right, so we are doing fence upgrades everywhere. So pretty much, if I can upgrade the fence, we're going to do it. Which it seems like this fence upgrading tool might be a little buggy. There we go. So let's do that. Out to the fence here and out around. Actually, we're going to make that to a privacy fence. There we go. Fence has been upgraded. All right. And I've got one more to upgrade here and we should be good. All right. So with the anticipation that we're going to be unlocking some more dinosaurs soon, I think it's time to start another pin. And this is going to be a rather large one. This is going to be maybe a little bit more of an experiment. Uh, we're going to have our largest pin to date. So it's actually going to start. I'm going to leave it a little bit off the main path here. Or I don't want to put it along the main path. You know, I think we're going to do that. Let's, uh... Let's move this bathroom real quick. We'll move it over as a temporary location. We'll move it here. All right, so this is going to be a big pin. It's a little bit of experiment here. So let's go boom. Let's go boom. And we're going to move this one up to here. All right, we need to get rid of some more stuff here along the path. All right, so I have the pin built. I'm not sure what we're going to put in it yet, but I just want to have it here. That way I can lay out the park a bit more, because we might do some more guest things here soon. Going to add two doors to this, put one down there. There we go. But yeah, I just want to have this thing ready to go. That way, once we fill it up, we should be able to put something new in here. Alright, so we're unlocking some more stuff for the park. We can finally unlock bathrooms, and that... Yeah, that's a big thing. Okay, so what else do we have? Looks like we got some... Like a playground and stuff like that. Ooh, that could be cool. Or is that for the, uh... Actually, I do think that's for the guest. Here, we need to unlock some of that. We need to start placing some of the new stuff in here. So we got a bathroom now. So let's put a proper bathroom over by the food court. So we can go... Uh, we'll stick it more to this side. Boom! 
There we go. It's kind of a small bathroom, but yeah, that guy's pumped about that bathroom. <laughs> so yeah, we got that. We'll go ahead and stick another one in the park over this way, and we can get rid of some of the outhouses and stuff like that. So other park upgrades that we can do. What is this, a science gate? Oh, that's another way to generate more science. We'll probably actually add that here in a second. Uh, we got a banana stand. Uh, so let's go ahead and add that to our food court. Boom, banana stand now. We have a wide variety of food here at the park. Uh, let's go ahead and get some more decorations in. There's a Triceratops uh, water fountain. I'm sure they would love to see that across from their cage. The little terrors. Let's go and place that there. It's trying to add all the uh, all the little bitty upgrades that I can to make the the guest be a little bit more satisfied with the park. So we'll keep doing little stuff here and there. So I'm noticing most of the time when I see like an upset little thing above somebody's head, it's because of the decorations around the park. So we're really going to start stepping that up and try to decorate as much as possible here. Think about adding these potted flowers up and down uh, the sidewalks here. That actually looks good. Yeah, I'm going to add plenty of these. They can't complain about the decorations after this. And then once we're through decorating the park, we're going to try to get some more dinosaurs in here. Make them extra happy. Alright, so we're ready to get some more dinosaurs, so let's go ahead and unlock the next group, that way we can get searching for them and we can get them in here in our new enclosure. Alright, so while we're searching for the, uh, the new dinosaur, uh, let's go ahead and put in another raptor here. So we got the egg, we'll place this in, that'll put three for this little area. I could say we get, uh, how big do these get? They're pretty small, I don't know if that's full grown. I think we can at least get one or two more in here, that way we can fill this enclosure. Alright, so while we're waiting on the uh, dig teams, we're going to go ahead and unlock some more fun packs here. Now this should make it to where we can start adding some cool stuff for the park. Uh, we got two of the packs unlocked. Let's see what items that unlocks. I think it unlocks a playground, if I'm not mistaken. So that would be kind of cool to have for the park. Yeah, look at that. We have a basic playground. Do we have a bigger one than the basic? Guess we'll unlock that later. How big is this thing? Oh, that's cool. I don't want to stick it right in the middle, but I need to make the paths actually get to it. So maybe this will be right here and then we'll uh, make it to where the paths can get up to it. That way people can go walk on the playground. There we go. I wonder if people will actually use this or if it's just kind of there for show. I'm hoping they'll actually use it, but that kind of works as a centerpiece. So there we go. Oh, look, there's people on it. All right, let's get over to the expedition room. All right, time to search for some new dinosaurs. I might have to do this several times uh, before I actually get enough for like eggs and stuff for the new dinosaurs. So we'll just kind of start unlocking here. And once I'm ready to continue and get some eggs, I'll show you guys that and we'll see what dinos we can make. All right, we're still waiting on teams to uncover some more. Let's go and unleash this raptor here. There we go. Got another little raptor. All right, so I got another employee building I can get in. I think it's the lounge. I had like an employee room, and I think this is, yeah. Oh, it's a resort, Never mind. Okay, so this unlocks more employee potential. Uh, so we're gonna place it back here. We'll add a little path to it. There we go. And then we'll make a little path that leads up to this area. That way they can get in it. So this should make it where your employees can level themselves up even more, which is gonna be good. Uh, that way we can unlock their potential, level them up, and make the guest in the park even more happy. I feel like we will unlock everything as far as all the items within the next episode or two. Now, not necessarily the dinosaurs. I still have to grind away for those, but still, we're making some pretty impressive progress. We can get a new dinosaur now. It's called the... Uh, I don't even know how to say that. It starts with an S. We'll see what it looks like when it comes out. I can actually do three of these, I think. Let's go, what, one, two? Okay, I got two of them. We can get a third one once we get some more footprints, which I'll go ahead and send the, uh, we'll send the team back out here. So now we'll know kind of what we need to deal with and what kind of exhibit this next one needs to be. So swamp. Ooh, that's the first time we've done swamp. Uh, let's see, I think it's gonna need to be like a muddy exhibit. So this is gonna be kind of exciting. So we'll go mud. And let's go up and boom. There's your mud. That doesn't really look muddy. It looks like there's mushrooms in there. Yeah, there is. All right, so I'm assuming a swamp's going to be pretty wet. So let's go ahead. Let's make it wet here. Okay, so it's a swamp right now. What else do we need? We need to go ahead and get some sort of... Actually, I think we're going to use plants that we've never used. Oh, no food. Oh, the delivery. People. 
I, I kind of, uh, it's kind of annoying you have to click that every time. Let's go ahead and buy some food real quick. That way we can get those uh, feeders filled back up. All right, so we're going to add plants we've never added before. So we got stuff like the tree stumps. So we'll get a couple of those in there. Uh, you got scary trees. That's kind of cool looking. It's going to give the uh, the park a little bit more of a diverse look, which is going to be nice. Okay, add some ferns here. All right, let's get some crystals here in the swamp. There we go. Add some of these. And then I'm going to go ahead and put some shelters, or at least one shelter in here for the dinos. That way they're going to be happy almost immediately. So, oh, I can do a, a large vegetarian feeder. Let's go ahead and get one of those. I probably need to upgrade the feeders in the, uh, the other pens here, too. Uh, let's see. We want a big shelter. Gonna put this back here. There we go. Alright, so they should start to fill that. Let's go ahead and get our eggs in here now. Uh, we'll check the biodiversity here. Let's go boom. And I keep saying biodiversity. I think it's biome diversity. Uh, looks like we can add a little bit more of everything to get this thing a bit more diverse. So let's keep adding some stuff here. Alright, so we are ready to go ahead and unleash our new dinosaurs here. There we go. Ah, look at them. Nice. They're kind of ugly, actually. What the heck? <laughs> it's a weird dinosaur. All right, so we got that new exhibit built. We're going to need to, next episode, try to get some more carnivores in the park to make it more exciting for the guest. And then overall, try to make some more improvements. All right, so we can get the next fun pack, which includes a hat stand, which is really good. Let's go ahead and get that. That way we can uh, get that going. And well, let's see. Let's keep up the... Uh, Let's keep up with the green planet over here. We'll get this Admiral Planet, which will give you a herbivore stand and a garbage bin. All right, so we can actually get some pretty legit looking garbage bins. Stop it, Stegosaurus. We're trying to get out of your pen. We'll have to figure that pen out. I don't know. That pen's kind of boxed in now, and eventually, I think it's going to need to be bigger. So we'll have to see what we're going to do there. Uh, let's get that. We should have another thing that we can build in the stands, I think. And we get a hat stand now. That'll make us some money. Let's put that... We'll put it in the food court area. Let's go over here and go hat stand. Boom. Sell some hats and make some money. All right. And over here, I think we're going to do one more little guest area in between pens. So I think we're going to put a, uh, a playground over here. And we'll have like a little park area for the guests too. Uh, we'll add some decorations and stuff. So let's go ahead and add a path here. That kind of wraps around. I have to move that garbage bin real quick. And then I'll probably need to grass this area in for the guests too. All right, they can't complain about the lack of fun because this park's got a lot of stuff in it now. We'll got to here, and this will all be park area for the guest. Oh, that over uh, that went over my path there. Dang it! So we're gonna add that, and we're gonna add a uh, we have photo booths, uh, T Rex. Let's not do the T Rex one yet because I want to have an actual T Rex, but we can make some money off this photo booth too. Look at that, that's pretty cool. Alright, so we got a new upgrade. So this episode, we really didn't add too many more pins. We got some more dinosaurs, dealt with an outbreak, upgraded a ton of more stuff, upgraded our fences, our emission booth, added the new park, which includes playgrounds. I think we're doing pretty well for ourselves. But anyways, I think it's going to wrap it up for this episode. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this. Uh, let me know what you guys think, what you want to see next out of this series down below. And like I said, I want to thank you guys for all the love and support on this series, and we will see you guys next time in Parkasaurus.